need to stop. Come over here so we can see what they're doing. Okay, be careful. Oh, my wiener. <laughs> wiener. Oh my god, both my wieners. <laughs> I need my wiener. I'm going to see if mine's getting... Wait, I don't know. Uh, okay. Maybe we can go eat them now. Okay. Now I need a button. No. Okay. What do you want to drink? Um, um a purple care dry. Okay, y'all, so me and my daughter were just out by the fire. She's in the tent right here. You know, we're just hanging out. I just fed the fire some more. The fire's going. It's really nice, warm, and toasty, but it is pretty cold tonight. Um, over here, we just ate, you know, we just ate hot dogs over here. I have my Upes portable power station I showed y'all in a video. I'll link that video right up here in the corner if you're interested in checking that out. It's a really awesome portable power station, and on the back, it has a light. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but okay, so I'm like right here behind the light, okay? So that's, I guess that's the highest setting right there. And that's the brighter setting. And I got a blinking setting. And I'm just gonna turn it back on. <laughs> All right, this is my little tea kettle I bought at Walmart. Y'all, yes, before we came here, we stopped and got McDonald's because, because it was rushing this morning. <laughs> like, uh, the check-in time here is 2 o'clock. We got here like at 2.47. So I'm just going to pour this in here to heat it back up. It's decaf because, y'all, I would not want to be drinking no um, <laughs> caffeine right now and not be able to sleep tonight. So, you know, with it being cold out here, I don't want us to get sick. So I think we're going to sleep in the back of the SUV, which y'all is like way over there. I mean, it's not. I mean, I have my flashlight. I have this. All right, and this light I have is a Streamlight Super Tac. My dad got me this several years ago, and I use it ever since. I always use it at night to take the dog to go potty. It's super bright. Actually, it needs more flashlights, but it's pretty good light. As you can see, this is all around us. <laughs> it's a really good light. So that's the car right there. <laughs> okay, so that's my light. I've been having that for many years. All right, I'm going to go put this by the fire because I just want it to heat my coffee up. Y'all, we got all sorts of stuff, too. We got um, some popcorn. 
and we're gonna be making s'mores tonight and then we're just gonna stay by the campfire hang out a little bit all right I'm gonna put this over here Boop. just like that and then when it's ready I will just try to scoop it off I have oven mitts and also I could probably use um, that thing I have over there to grab it so I'm just gonna let it heat up because I want some nice good hot coffee it's cold out here Ugh. all that smoke <laughs> just got right into smoke's way all right I have my drink I was drinking but it's kind of too cold for this so let me put this back in my ice chest right here got stuff in here trying to keep it cold I bought this at Walmart this is like a little thing for my eggs as you can see, I have like seven eggs in here. That's going to be for breakfast in the morning along with those sausage links. So that I'm going to cook outdoors. I don't think I'm going to camp cook it over the campfire we have going on because I don't want to have it running tomorrow before we leave. But I'm going to use my little, I think it's the Coleman camp stove I borrowed from my dad. I'm going to use that over here. I don't know if you can see it. I should have showed you this more during the day time, but I think you might have seen when I shine the camera over here but this is our little hand washing station y'all this is so perfect I used to have one of these years ago for one of my daughter's birthday parties she had you know for a, a punch bowl thing you know and it has a little thing whoop, like that that's perfect to wash your hands when you're camping oh that scared me that car <laughs> started over there <sighs> can y'all see that <sighs> kind of cold you can see my own breath but this is our little hand washing station for our s'mores we got these huge marshmallows me and my daughter we just could not pass these up when we seen these <laughs> for our s'mores and then instead of bring the whole box of graham crackers I just brought you know a little pouch of it that was in there these marshmallows are for hot chocolate if you want to do hot chocolate and I'm gonna throw those chips in there because I'm not gonna leave any of this out tonight when we go to the car <laughs> we already have it set up to sleep in because I just don't want to sleep out here because I think this I mean the sleeping bag is good that we got from Walmart but like the fly my daughter's in there but um you know let me see like if you look underneath here like right there it's just a net so it's not really blocking the cold air the cold damp air from going in and what you're gonna be breathing all night so we are definitely sleeping in the car <laughs> You know, every now and then we'll hear a noise in the woods, but I mean, it's probably just animals, you know, like there, I just heard something. <laughs> I mean, it could be deer. There's a lot of deer back here. If you see and my thing's probably ready. All right, y'all, sorry. I have to pause it because my little tea kettle's ready. Oh, it sounds so cute. <coughs> Okay, let me bring it over here. I wonder if it's okay if I, now I'm gonna put it on the wood because I don't want it. I'm gonna put it right there on the seat. Let me open up my coffee cup right here. Hmm. I don't know, V. I'm not really too much of a tea kettle type of person, but am I supposed to open that to pour it out? <laughs> I don't know. Let me see. Okay, I went ahead and opened it because that was kind of getting on my nerves. All right, so I'm going to let this cool off. I'm just going to rinse it up. See this thing right here? See? Yeah. This thing's hot right here. I'm just going to leave it right here on the seat on this wood, okay? Huh? You got tea? Okay, hang. Well, I gotta. All right, my daughter wants to make tea. Oh, yeah. Okay, I gotta rinse it out. It's hot. You gotta wait. Okay. Ooh, that's gonna be nice and hot, y'all. Ooh. It kind of, I think. I think I'm just gonna put it over here. I don't know. Let's see what's gonna happen. Oh, let me get my little oven glove because I wanna be prepared. 
when it's time. I might as well bring my coffee over there too. Let's see. Is that as, as big as they get? I don't know. I don't do this kind of popcorn. <laughs> Probably. I thought it would get a lot bigger than that. No, it's still popping. Mm -hmm. Right here. Yeah. The whole thing might catch on fire. <laughs> I hope it don't catch on fire, V. I don't think it will. Pull it back some and let's see. Is it? No. Okay. It's really smoking now. But you did. You have some. Yeah. Oh, it I'm anxious to see how this popcorn's going to turn out. If it's going to be, um. Good or bad. Yeah, if it's going to be burnt. <laughs> Well, I told you to fix another hot dog because, oh, it's on fire. Pull it back. <laughs> oh, great. V, dang it. I told you. Dang it. Look <laughs> it's on fire. <laughs> dang it. Oh, V. <laughs> Look at it. Wait, I need to turn my flash on. I told you not to put it directly over the fire. Oh, but look at that popcorn. <laughs> Girl, 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 girl. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh. Mom, that's our Stop. food. <laughs> I'm gonna go get a bowl. A bowl? I'll go get the plate. Oh, yeah, one, a paper plate. We'll we'll put it on a paper plate. Oh, is my phone on fire? My phone feels just for one. We're gonna put it right here in between us. I don't know where to put this without it catching it back on fire. Okay. My phone feels hot. I gotta take this flash off. It's hot. Careful. Okay, let's see how this came out. This is bad. <laughs> it doesn't look good either. Just don't eat the burnt ones. It's <laughs> like burnt. I wonder mm. if any. I wonder if anybody down the street can smell it. Oh, don't let that. V, don't touch it. Let it cool off. Some. Okay, I'm gonna put this. We just leave this right here because this is very hot. We're gonna have to leave that right there and let it cool off. We can't put it in a garbage bag or anything. Okay, let me try one. Mm. These are good. Mm. just don't eat the brown or black ones. Okay. Mm -hmm. My microwave could make better popcorn. <laughs> okay, y'all, look at these huge marshmallows. We're about to go roast some marshmallows and make some s'mores. Remember for Ghostbusters? <laughs> oh, Ghostbusters. Yeah, the new one. The little marshmallow guys. They were, they were like catching themselves on fire and roasting each other. That was a cute movie. Mm -hmm. That's a huge ass marshmallow. What time? The ain't nothing. Okay, so I think this big marshmallow was a mistake because it's just making more of a mess, mm. and it takes longer for it to melt. And then you know the inside still not. It didn't melt the chocolate, so I don't know. It's such a pain in the butt. Okay, so this little thing right here, it opens up really big for you to blow. Excuse me. So you can blow onto your fire, and we just, uh, our fire died out, and we just put the log in, and this thing works really good, really, really good. Are you recording? Mm, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dang girl, we got it going on. Okay, so we just took a bathroom break by the car. <laughs> um, we just opened two doors, stand in between the door and 
pee into a large McDonald's cup <laughs> and then dump it in the woods. And um, have a little trash bag there with toilet paper. And we have a we have a trash can by our site, so we just went and brought that there. <laughs> then we inside our pee cup because we are not about to pop a squat into these woods at night <laughs> and have a raccoon or something chase up on us. Hey y'all, so this is how we're set up <laughs> in the car. Um, surprisingly, it's pretty comfortable back here. We can lay down. Tell them about the raccoon. I am. We can lay down, completely lay down and stretch out back here. I can't do the wide angle on this uh, with my flash one, but so we're back here. We have our heated blanket keeping warm. It's plugged into the UPES portable power station. Oh, what's my back? I can't get up. Okay, so this is on. Oh, let me see. Don't, don't push me, V. Okay, we're at 82%. Veronica, stop. We're charging both of our phones here. And I have this plugged in and we're at 82%. So we have that. We have all of our stuff. It's a good thing I brought all of our, like, food in the car with us because we just went outside to potty. See that McDonald's cup right there? We didn't use that one because we didn't we wouldn't put it back on the dashboard, but there's one in our little trash bag. <laughs> um we just open the door, both doors, and then put this blanket. We take one turns. of us will take turns holding the blanket on the other way. And we just pee in a cup <laughs> and then pour it out in the grass. Um instead of going all the way to the restrooms and I think going to the restrooms late at Longer. night is more dangerous. dangerous. It would be more dangerous, you know. You don't know if some weirdo would follow you in there. Then we have the um <laughs> the sun protector. What do you call that thing? Sun pro protector, yeah. Right there so nobody can see us from this way. But um yeah. Oh, and when we got out to go use the bathroom right here just now, I think it's about ten o'clock at night, we seen a raccoon um <clears throat> being nosy around our campsite so that's why i'm glad i mm. picked up <laughs> i picked up our food and bag of chips and all the only thing that's out there is the ice chest but and v he's probably over there because that popcorn you spilt i can from... spill it you spill it because remember you flipped it and you saw the hole and you did it like Poof. no but you kept you were snacking on it and you kept throwing pieces all over the place I and you even fire. spit some out because you ate some of the kind that yes, we caught on fire <laughs> Girl, I just found one of your chips back here. Really? <laughs> Don't. Oh my god, it's so gross. But underneath here, I have my yoga mat. Not that I do yoga. <laughs> but I have, I, a, I have a yoga mat. It's really thin, y'all. I need to get something for when we go camping. Especially back here. Maybe we can eventually get us like one of those tiny little air mattresses. There's people turning their car lights off. I wonder what they're doing. Oh, y'all, we're being nosy because the people across from us, they came home and they just been in their car with the car lights on for like an hour. Now we're making them out. <laughs> <laughs> they're probably making out, my daughter says. No telling what they're doing. But um, we're in here. Uh, I have my car key hanging up right there. So, you know, I don't accidentally hit any panic alarm on my car and make the car go off <laughs> while we're <laughs> sleeping. And yes, so that is what we got going on. Let me see. Oops. We have our pillows right here. My daughter's <laughs> squish marshmallow <laughs> pillow. <laughs> and yeah, so that is how we are camping out tonight. <coughs> yeah. Avi, let me see. Yeah, you're running a fever. <coughs> um, yeah. I'm drinking on that little chip. You shouldn't have eaten that cheap, cheap, cheap. You shouldn't have eaten that cheap. <laughs> Why would you eat that cheap? No one more. You want more of the cheap? Yeah, I do. Okay, so that is it. We are just going to go lay down and go to bed, I guess. When it's really dark in here, you can see through the windows. If we, you know, wipe the fog off, we can see all the um, stars. So, all right, you guys. In the morning, we're going to be cooking breakfast and... Maybe exploring a little bit around this place and maybe do some hiking. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Good night. Oh my God, you guys. <laughs> so we slept in the car last night because it was freezing. And then we woke up this morning. Well, last night when we came out here to pee, we peed 
you know, in between the car doors. And we was shining the light this way. We seen a raccoon, but we scared him off. This morning, he must have came back because this egg, he got a hold of our ice chest. Our ice chest is open. I'll show you in a second. But this egg thing my daughter just fetched, that was way over there in the woods. Okay, let me just show you what he did, okay? That egg carton was over there in the woods. He's got his little nasty ass footprints all over here, being a little nosy, no good, son of a, you know what? Look, my baby wipe center is all dirty from him. He, look, look what he did, look. Look what this little asshole did. <laughs> oh, we left the popcorn here. <laughs> that, well, it was burnt popcorn. Damn it, that's our fault. Okay, so look what he did to our ice chest. He opened that little opened the ice chest. I didn't know they could open freaking ice chest. Nobody told me that. <laughs> that little son of a gun. He opened the ice chest, okay? Okay, I can understand. It's our fault. We left the popcorn here, the burnt, burnt popcorn that caught on fire, okay? Oh, oh, and the sausage we was going to have for breakfast this morning, guess what? eat it he ate it <laughs> oh my goodness he ate the sausage he pulled out the barbecue sauce because he wanted some barbecue sauce on his sausage oh my goodness y'all <sighs> so instead of just packing all this away now i got a freaking ice chest to clean I should have brought some Clorox wipes because that little thing's going to be all nasty full of his nasty little raccoon germs. Sometimes you got to learn your lesson the hard way and this is a prime example right here. <laughs> We're going to have a mess to clean when we get home. Oh man. Okay, next time we go camping, we know we're sleeping in the car. I'm not even putting the tent up. I'm not leaving nothing out here. Okay, alright you guys. We're going to go ahead and start cleaning this up. You know, leave no trace. That raccoon don't know to leave no trace. Let me get started. We're gonna go ahead and pick up camp early. It's like 8 a.m. right now. Thanks, V. I got a little plastic glove from the car. Um, all right, so might as well get started and I'm just gonna leave the campsite. We're just gonna go start our day early. Well, we might go get some McDonald's breakfast, which is right down the street, um, a little into the city around here. Then we're going to come back and we're going to hit the trails here. Well, we're going to try. If we have time, we're going to hit the trails in the little beach area and all. We'll show you guys that. Take you along with us. All right. <sighs> Y'all, look how dirty he made my ice chest. Look at it. It's like black water. He did that. And look at all the stuff we had to throw away and waste because that little a-hole. <laughs> look. All those canned drinks, that mayonnaise, that was a brand new mayonnaise. Capri Suns, all that. Well, he did. He did eat the food. He ate the sausages. And he took the hot dogs, the leftover hot dogs. And I don't know where the hot dogs are. Um, could be anywhere. I see some kind of trash back there. But, I mean, I don't know what that little son of a gun did. Mm. <laughs> All right, so we cleaned up our campsite. Everything's picked up. Y'all, the tent was really wet, so I just put it in a big old black um, construction bag, and I guess I'm just gonna set it up at home, put it in the sun, let it dry out, because I just don't want it to mildew. I didn't even put it back in the tent bag. I'm just gonna, um, yeah, put it in the sun. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it in the sun when we get home for it to dry out. But we cleaned everything up here. All right, so we cleaned everything up here. This is the last thing I gotta take to the car. Um, yeah, really sucks putting all this dirty stuff in the car, but all right, so right now it's probably like eight. No, it's probably about nine, 9 a.m. right now.
Yes, I stay back. Right there. Right there. So you guys, you saw them? Yeah, I seen them far away swimming. I told you there's alligators in here. Where is he? When you said alligator, I thought there's an alligator right there, you guys. In this pond. Every time I come to this park, I always see parents let their kids play right here along this water line around this pond and there's like a little splash pad over there as you can see oh man I mean you just cannot let your kids play around unknown water especially in Louisiana with all the alligators that's just a no a big no what if he comes over here? well then we run like crazy <laughs> but if there's one there's more every time I come here I see an alligator in this pond oh where is he I lost him He's over here. Okay, now I see him. Okay. Yeah, I wonder if he sees us. Look, there he goes. He's moving. There he's, he's moving. Open. Yep. There he goes. What is that? I don't know. Is it a deer track? Okay, so also this pond right here, they got alligators in it. But also they have a beach area over there. It's early in the morning, so it's not crowded like it usually is. But that's Lake Pontchartrain. Y'all, there is alligators in Lake Pontchartrain. We come here, we've seen them on this beach too. And people come here with their kids, letting their kids swim in that nasty water. You can't even see an inch below that muddy water. There's alligators in there. Y'all, I've been to the Mississippi Beach. The, the beach beach, not a lake, but the beach. There's alligators in that water too, <laughs> okay? So down here you got to be really careful because there's alligators everywhere. He's there. 